Okay, rail, roll. All right, back on this uh, 750C display. We powered it up. I got myself. All right, now it's set up. It's booted up. Everything's uh, settled down. It always comes up in PAS1 mode. You always have to change that. So two quick presses of the M button over here on the handlebar switch, once you're powered up, brings up the menu. And you see there's display settings and basic settings. The power button will switch between those two screens once you're in here. When you use the plus minuses, you can scroll through these selections. Exit, of course. System, you can change some imperial metric. Blah, blah. I think most of that stuff people are aware of. But when you want to go to the advanced menu, you have to press the power button once to bring up basic settings. That you get your wheel size, your power volt, your voltage of your battery, your start password if you want to change it. And then you go into the advanced uh, settings here as well. Select that up and then you have to enter this password. It's kind of the long lost password. In this system here, it's going to be one, one, nine, nine. Then hit that there, and we get into things here that the advanced. Okay. Yeah, what's your yeah, finger yeah. hanging over there so yeah. it doesn't shade that? <laughs> so, into advanced settings. Unfortunately, or fortunately, as the case may be, okay, we're back to setting up the password. You have to go into input password. It's a one, one, nine, ah, nine. Okay, M button. Now you're into these things. Unfortunately, most of these don't seem to do anything. You can change them, but they just seem to be ignored, or I don't know what they do, to be honest with you. Like even this throttle 6KM, I have no idea what that does. I change it, I come back, power the unit down, turn it back on, it comes back as in. And the same on the next page when you go there. This here throttle level, that's supposed to override the PAS mode, which the standard, you know, the older displays are always full throttle, it seems like. But when I select this, I can change it to what, yes. All right, it's all selected. Go on. We'll exit out there. All right, you saw what that was up on S. Now look what happens. I'll power the system down. We go down. It's off. I bring it back up. Hang with us there. All right. Okay, we're booted up. Two quick presses. Got into this menu. Go over to basic settings. Down in here to advance like we just went through all of a sudden again. Input the password. Have a birthday while we're waiting on this. All right, back into here. All right, input password, uh, speed limit. The next page, throttle level, back to in. So I don't know. It, there's a lot of these ses settings. They seem to say you can change them, but when it comes down to it, you can't. So just be be aware that maybe not all these things are available to us. I will exit back out of here. Oh, dang it, I wanted to go to the advancement. Let's take a pause, though, and we'll uh, move on to the, one other thing in the advanced menu people might find useful.